a loud crash. Omaha police say this black Durango was speeding down Leavenworth near 25th Street Thursday evening when it collided with another vehicle, hit a pole, and crashed into a parked car. We were there in 20 or 30 seconds. Already patrolling in the area, Omaha police officer Sterling Hitch and his field training officer Aram Normandin were first to arrive on scene. Officer Normandin went to help the driver and Hitch, the passenger. I saw the uh, one of the front passenger seat. She had a tremendous hand wound. Uh, her hand appeared partially severed. Officer Hitch says the woman, 39-year-old Teresa Jaramillo, didn't have much time. I saw a lot of blood loss and, and knew that uh, we needed to jump into action pretty quick. Fresh out of OPD's Lateral Officer Academy, Hitch put his training to work, grabbing a high pressure or Israeli bandage out of his cruiser and wrapping it around Jaramillo's hand. Shortly after, a sergeant arrived on scene. He applied that tourniquet and uh, which which cut off the, the blood supply to the hand, which, which um, no doubt saved her life. OFD got there moments later. Hitch says they recognized him and his fellow officers for their quick and critical response. You train for a situation like that and then it happens and then it, a lot of times it, it develops and you react exactly how you, how you were trained. Tonight, 39-year-old Teresa Jaramillo is in fair condition at Nebraska Medicine. The driver of the Durango is also there recovering from a fractured neck. The backseat passenger has now been released. OFD tells me it's made the mayor and police chief aware of the officer's actions and is proud of them for stepping up to save a life. Both the fire and police department say this illustrates how both agencies work together to protect their communities.